a patient will calmly come into our office and say, what can you do for me? And we, we, that sometimes leads us into catch-22. You don't want to point out faults on the, on the patient, um, but at the same time you want to address what you see may be appropriately uh, affected by the, the options that you have uh, in your arsenal. Commonly when we, when we address a patient, we will actually give them a mirror and, and have them point out specifically what bothers them because people say, well, everything, and, and it really is not everything. There are certain things that bother them, and we have them point out what bothers them and then address each individual uh, problem appropriately on, on a variety of different things that we can do. And most commonly is there's not just one thing you can do. You can actually treat a variety of uh, treatments in order to have the uh, resulting uh, response that, you, that a patient wants. However, most people come in and they just want their skin to look better. And our usual approach is that we tell people that when we address the skin, we're actually talking about three different layers. We're talking about the surface. The surface consists of color, of both red and brown discolorations, and also a little bit of the texture, including the pore size. Then there's the middle layer, which uh, is the collagen layer, and that is more commonly associated with wrinkles. And then we have the deeper layer, which is um, more the fatty layer, which we address with fillers. And then we finally have the final layer, which is more muscular, which we address both with a little bit of the fillers and with Botox. And so we'll uh, explain to people that we commonly do a variety of different treatments in order to get the best effect. We'll use the, the for the surface, we commonly will use photorejuvenation to affect both red and brown and a little bit of the texture. For the middle layer, which is the wrinkles, we'll come use the 1540 fractional uh, or Botox in order to affect some of the wrinkles. For the lower layer, which is more the fat, uh, fatty layer, uh, we will use a filler such as Sculpture or Rustlin or Juvederm or Artifil in order to, to build up uh, the tissue. And finally, when we talk about the muscular layer, we will commonly uh, use uh, Botox in order to affect it and have people maybe even do some exercises on the face in order to strengthen the muscle layer.